in Amsterdam. The cruise boats keep gliding along the brown canal as quiet as prayer. The leaves are packed with peace. The elegant house fronts repetitive and banal as the hotel brochure, as still as an altarpiece. We cruise it with Rufus Collins once, a white macaw on his piratical shoulder. Rufus is gone. Canals spread reflection with calm at the core. I reflect quietly on how soon I will be going. I want the year 2009 to be as angled with light as a Dutch interior or an alley by Vermeer, to accept my enemy's atrabilious spite, to paint and write well in what could be my last year. Silly to think of a heritage when there isn't much, though my mother, whose surname was Marlin or Van der Mont, took pride in an ancestry she claimed was Dutch. Now here in Amsterdam, her claim starts to mount, legitimate, illegitimate. I want to repaint those rubicund Flemish faces even if it's been done by Franz Hals, by Rubens, by Rembrandt, the clear gray eyes of René, the tree shade on this side, the chestnuts that glitter from the breakfast window, why should I not claim them as fervently as the pride of Alex Marlin, an early widow, as a creek in the Congo, if her joy was such I feel something ending here and something begun. The light, strong leaves, the water muttering in Dutch, the girls going by on bicycles in the sun.